Hello from Doha, the capital of Qatar, I'm Martina Fuchs. Here at the very first Web Summit in the Middle East, one of the world's largest technology conferences, I spoke to the event CEO, Catherine Maher, about this year's highlights and her take on the Chinese technology space. Take a listen. Uh, it has been just an amazing event. It has been so busy on the floor. We've had people come in from 118 countries, the most international first year event ever. And China has made a really significant investment in some of these foundational technologies like climate technology, for example, uh, AI, machine learning, drones, etc. So clearly this is a place that the con country has made a bet that this is going to be incredibly important to the future of its economic development and global positioning. And I expect that you know we're only going to see more of that. The proximity to China, of course, is, represents an opportunity as well. Uh, of course, there's so much going on in the Chinese uh, entrepreneurial ecosystem. There's so much advanced research being done in China on sort of fundamental technologies. And so we hope to only continue to, to grow that and showcase that. The numbers uh, at the event have been 37% of our attendees are women. Uh, our speakers on stage, about a third, are women as well. We're very excited, of course, to only continue to make that ratio more, more equitable. My view in, in this is that technology is such an incredible equalizer, and this is such a great way for women to have uh, get involved in, in both in terms of learning essential skills to be a technologist or to start your own company and to have that independence and agency. Um, to be an investor and to be able to be thinking about and choosing what's next and helping shape the world. So women in technology is really the future.